Advise run up complete. We got the aircraft in tow and stop. We'll get right in. What's cool about this little airport, uh, I like it. They got a kid's playground. Oh, yeah, look right at that. Yeah, isn't that sweet? I like that. Get the young people involved with aviation. Very good career. Okay, here's Alpha. Making a left here. Okay, got tower standing by. And for those uh, tuning in, so it's about a two-hour flight um, back to uh, New York. Uh, it's uh, Peachtree Tower, I think at 430 Delta Charlie. Holding short the ILS uh, uh, hold line, ready for takeoff, 2-1 left. I'm Jet 430 Delta Charlie, Peace Street Tower, wind 27013, turn left heading 090, runway 21 left, clear for takeoff. Clear for takeoff, uh, Honda Jet 430 Delta Charlie, I'm on takeoff, uh, turn to heading uh, 0900 Delta Charlie, thank you. You got that, Adam? Yep. So climbing to 3000, left turn it, uh, to the east, which is their normal here, we're clear for takeoff. I got the old school phone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, we're going to center up here on the runway, and I'm doing full power before brake release. Okay. To the carrots, we're good. Wind is off the right, so right aileron. Sears 427, hold on, Papa, Peachtree okay. Tower. Traffic's far and parallel runways on Honda Jet, turning due east. Left turn out approved, runway 2 and right to clear for takeoff. And there. For takeoff, 2 and right. V1, uh, and and V-rotate, there we go. You rotate two good engines. Gear is coming up. MCT. Flaps are coming up. Climb up a little bit and start our left turn. Okay. Number zero, Delta Charlie, left turn to zero nine zero, contact land departure. In the turn to zero nine zero, over to departure. Zero Delta Charlie, have a good day. Okay. Okay. Visual yeah. to a Delta Charlie, pilot. Good five sixty three contact Peachtree Tower at Cham one two zero point nine or good day. Going to capture altitude and heading. A little bit of power. Oh, a little uh, Atlanta departure. Hundred jet four three zero Delta Charlie uh, twenty nine hundred feet for three thousand. Five four three zero Delta Charlie Atlanta departure. I don't maintain five thousand. There you go on my ident five thousand four three zero Delta Charlie. Thank you. He cleared us to five thousand. Yep. And a clear truck 459 is all right. Go through our checklist. Uh, heading Landing three, gear is done. Your dampers are engaged. Four, try, down, climb, maintain, Flaps five, seven, are eight. up. Thrust levers are at MCT. Uh, we'll be pulling them back though shortly. Five, 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 Black guidance is good. Ice protection not needed. Cabin signs not needed. On five Echo Victor, proceed direct to Sham on a localizer and effective visual. We'll see how much traffic Atlanta has. It's like New York. Busy it is. For, uh, 515 Echo Victor. All right, next list uh, pressurization. Yeah, it's starting to pressurize. It's good. So hazy here still and all over the East Coast and even the Midwest from the Canadian fires. I heard the weather's improving a little bit in New York. So uh, just to brief everybody, so we just departed PDK, which is one of the uh, airports in Atlanta where you, if you don't want to deal with the brain damage of ATL, which we don't, uh, we could always fly into ATL, but why would you? Um, this is closer to where you need to be and a lot easier to get in and out of. So we just departed that and uh, we're holding here at 5,000 feet. As you can see on the screen on the right, <laughs> there's a lot of traffic in Atlanta, but you know what? Uh, they are pros here, they know how to manage that. America 1598, clear direct to uh, Chaos, and descend and maintain level 2 Chaos is a waypoint. I'm, I'm thinking chaos they named that back in the Get Smart days. Remember that? Think? Sure. Yeah. Direct chaos and direct destination. Yeah, who was the guy that would like hide out in trash cans and, and stuff? And November 850, Mike oh, Brown, uh, they request again. That was a good show. Uh, Shaw, Sierra, Sierra, Charlie. And he had the shoe to phone? Take me around. That fell. I wonder whose desk that is sitting on now. Huh? I wonder whose desk that is sitting on now. Yeah, right. The original shoe phone. Yeah. Or where that Sunbeam Tiger is. <laughs> so, uh, ladies and gentlemen, we're, we're at uh, 41,000 feet, a.k.a. The traffic? Yeah, but he's below us. 1,000 feet? Never yeah. Delta Charlie reading for weather avoidance. Advice ready to copy. 
BirdVise edification. They just gave us a uh, route around the weather. We're painting it here. We could see it out the window. You could be able to see it on the cameras. And uh, so we got the next red over here. We got the onboard radar. So this is to the second. So we got both working for us. No big deal. And frankly, if we needed to, we could probably top it, go up to 43,000. So uh, that's what we're, they gave us a route here. And we'll probably still have to go a little bit, still deviate a little bit left to right. So we're uh, doing 400 knots. We were doing a little bit better before, but the, the chop kind of does take away from some of the airspeed. But this ain't bad at, at 41,000 feet. Ground speed is 406. So in miles per hour, yeah, now we're back up to 403. It's going to vary a few knots. Storms, that's why they're holding over Washington. I was wondering what's going on. We'll go full screen on that. That's at 916, yeah. clear direct scarp. Look at the uh, scarp. That's why those airliners had a hold. Understood. Understandable. The fish hook that they, I always call it the fish hook, they'd love to give us. But usually around here, and watch, good afternoon. They may make us go out to Sardi. Try and negotiate that we can get to Tier Park at least and get back into farming again. We're going to start getting in, yeah, the information. I cheat. I go to VTAR instead of RAW, decoded. I love that. A little less brain damage. So right now, Farmingdale, wind is 200 at 9 knots, so we're going to be definitely... Runway 19. Yeah, runway 19. Yes, sir. Which is actually 193 magnetic. Yeah. Yeah. Three miles of visibility. There's that haze. Thank you, Canada. We love you, but yeah. Uh, get your smoke. Otherwise, it's clear. 2.8. All right, so we know we're going to be landing into the haze. Very much like the takeoff. No big deal. And so we'll. I usually use the instrument approaches even in BFR conditions, anyhow. So we'll be definitely using instrument approach into runway 19. So we know that, and um, there's my approach checklist on the left side. I got it over here. Seatbelts, Adam and I are belted passengers. We can give them a briefing if we had them. Uh, we don't, so we don't have to worry about that. We don't have to worry about cabin Scenario signs. Scenario 424. Avionic set, we're going to do that here in a second. 424. Briefing the approach. That'd be 2,000 feet coming down, Mori 1,500 feet. Adam and I have this yeah, memorized. We've done this like, I don't know how many times. Sub to 7, uh, coming down to 328 feet, got to see the runway, or we're doing a missed approach. Missed approach is climbed to 2,000 feet, left turn to 3,000 feet, and back to Deer Park and hold. And uh, we can just zoom up to the plate. So they're going to bring us in over here at 2,000 feet, left turn, 2,000 feet, then down to 1,500 feet. Down here, missed approach, hooking left turn, initially 2,000 feet, then 3,000 feet to Deer Park. You concur? I concur. Okay. So we'll say go ahead and load. Now we've loaded that. Now it knows that we're landing runway 19. I can get weather. I can load the VTAR. Bingo, it pulls it from the satellite. And coming into 19,000 soon. Runway is 5,500 feet. Landing configure, ice protection will be off. Landing distance. It's a new thing Honda put in there, but it's kind of a pain that defaults to a very long landing distance on a day like today. Totally unnecessary. Uh, landing data. If we need 3,500 feet. We'll probably stop it less than that. Where do you want the power at 19? Uh, go to about. Uh, 85 to start, and then we'll bring it up to MCT. All right, we're going to have a eight knot headwind and a three knot crosswind off the right side. So we need a little bit more than half the runway. I'm going to go ahead and post that. We'll accept that. We've done that. It's all done. Cast messages so far are negative. We've done our briefing. That may not be student traffic. I wouldn't say this is a particularly good student day unless you're an IFR student with an instructor. The kind of day that could trip you up if you're yeah this is uh because technically it's vfr maybe marginal vfr but you tell me if you could see we know long island's not far in front of us and we can't see it all we see is white it's like we're in a we're in a cotton ball now for two ifr pilots it's like okay that's 
what we do. <laughs> but if you're a student out over the water and all of a sudden you can't, you don't know which way is land. You're like, ah, that's why getting your instrument rating. Anybody that's a VFR pilot that's watching this channel, get your instrument ticket as soon as possible. I did mine in the minimum 200 hours and that was... It, it just may save your life. Uh, yeah, oh yeah. Yeah, man, it's that hazy. I know I could see, like... I could see ground, but I wouldn't call yeah, this I'd say far. visibility is like, yeah, no. I don't know, maybe a mile? Yeah, I was going to say, I, I doubt three miles. Oh, like, shit. Shit. Absolutely not. See, I don't know if he's going to give us those that, or he's going to just vector us into towards Debbie. So that's why We're do. down at two. He's probably going to vector us. No, the, the Zosab is, is, yeah, Zosab is here. Yeah, you're, you're probably right, but we'll give it another second. So we could do vectors to find them multiple ways. You could do it here. You can also hit proc vectors to final. And I'm tending to agree with you, we're not going to get Zosab. So we'll go ahead and say vectors to final. Yeah. Okay, we've got that set up now. Magenta needles leading inbound. We have it up here. We have it up here, and we're coming on the approach plate. Right, you still see Moira. You still see Debbie. Yep. This is amazing. This is like apocalyptic. We're right at the Northport stacks. Yeah, you wouldn't know it. But yeah, I mean, see this is now. like you know out of a movie. He's gonna give us a left turn here soon. Yeah, somebody right at Debbie now. He'll have to bring us out a little bit. Yeah, Charlie, you're eight from Moray, heading two three zero two zero seven. Final approach, course, cut on one hundred approach. Clear for the approach, uh, two thousand till established zero. That's Charlie. Thank you. He's at two twenty, heading to join. Okay, we're on the approach. Heading FMS approach is on. We got it nice and slow. Zero, that's Charlie. Can't take Republic South. Over to Republic. Have a great day. Zero Delta Charlie. Delta Tower. Got Jet 430 Delta Charlie. Uh, just about to turn inbound at Debbie. Honda Jet 430 Delta Charlie. Republic Tower. Wind is 1907. Runway 19 or clear to land. 19 or clear to land. Zero Delta Charlie. And for Zero Delta Charlie, what's the speed of the traffic in front of us? Zero Delta Charlie, that traffic is a bonanza doing 110. Cheapers. Okay. All right, we'll throw that in gear. Yeah, I wouldn't say that they sequenced us too well. No, I'm coming I, to your coming to agreement with you. That was kind of. I just thought approach was going to take us to a little outside. Out, a little of bit Debbie, out, yeah. Just because of that guy on the inbound. We're ahead of the curve here. Can't slow it anymore. I could go. I could go one notch of flaps. Last notch of flaps. Prematurely to slow it down for this. Remember, yes. Charlie. Traffic. Your left rear has you in sight. They're maneuvering to follow you. Yeah, he's pretty close. He's only 600 feet above. Roger, he's got you inside. He's maneuvering follow. Okay, we don't. And November 55, five, Papa, you can reduce your speed or make a right 360. Traffic ahead is indicating 120. Okay, we'll do it. And Icarus 12, you can make the right okay. turn on my 14 Bravo. Final checklist. Gear is down. Full okay, flaps. Full Bravo parking. Slowing we'll it well. down. Landing gear is down. Full land. flaps. This is a flight. Yes, sir. You are going to land. That traffic is still your six o'clock and three now. miles. Okay, coming into the ref. The rep is 109. We got lights on or no? They come on automatically. Nice. Oh, yeah. Okay. Doing good. Airport in sight. Runway in sight. Perfect glide. Yep. Okay. A one low. No, it's on autopilot. It ain't me, boy. Look at that going to I'm, Echo. I'm going to be no, kicking off the right autopilot here. Right turn one. Autopilot uh, is coming off. Autopilot's off. And flying. Saying on glide slope. Gear down, flaps down. Yep. 500. Wilson power. So even though we're right nailing the glide slope, it's got three red masses now. It's two of two. It is V-Ref, a little bit power to hold. But that we're nailing the glide slope. Nailed. Yep. All right, now two, two red, two white. Yep. So they finally agree. Okay. And V-Ref is 109. We're 110. Okay, fourth. Okay, gears down, final Thank check. We'll be here. Full flaps and... 50, 40, 30. Power's out. 20. There's a thousand foot 10. marker. Nose comes down. Speed break out. You know, kill the 3, brake. 3,000. 3,000 feet Remember, left. Remember, Delta Charlie, stay parking. Atlantic. 
2000. With you, Bravo 6, uh, into Atlantic, you have a great night, too. Zero, that's Charlie, happy fourth. Thank you, sir, you too. I see that was a quid landing. What do you yeah, say? absolutely. I think we nailed it, my friend. I would say that was real, pretty good IFR conditions. Thanks for your help. I don't so if anybody has any questions, uh, obviously we can't answer them in real time, but uh, please, you know, post them. And if you like watching these videos, don't forget to, uh, you know, you know what to do. Hit the thumbs up, hit the subscribe button.